Here's a quick tip that will help you to stitch in a straight line. When I just got started sewing, my stitches looked like this. A trick that I was taught that helped me to stitch straighter was to get a page from a notebook and stitch along all the lines. If you practice doing this often enough, stitching in a straight line will become a lot easier to you. Another way to stitch in a straight line is to use your presser foot and throat plate as a guide. I recommend getting a throat plate like this one that has lines on it to represent the quarter inch, half inch, three quarter inch, and one inch marks. That way, you can keep your fabric in line with these marks while you stitch different allowances. So now I'm going to stitch with a half inch seam allowance and as you can see, my fabric is in line with the half inch mark. And for the purpose of top stitching, it's good to use your presser foot as a guide. From the needle to the edge of the presser foot is a quarter of an inch. So this is perfect when you're top stitching or stitching fabric together with a quarter inch seam allowance. Here I'm stitching with a quarter inch seam allowance and I'm using the edge of my presser foot as well as the line that's on the throat plate. That gives me a straight line like this and now I'm going to top stitch and in order to do that in a straight line, I'm aligning the inner edge of my presser foot with the edge of the fabric that I'm top stitching on. It turns out like this, which is also straight. Sometimes what I'll do is also use the screws on my actual sewing machine as a guideline and here I'm stitching with a one inch allowance. If this video was helpful for you, then give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend and subscribe for more sewing tips. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.